free for all. Hey guys, what's up? This Chick Scott Game here, and today I'm going to be recording my fifth Q&A. I'm just going to be scrolling through all the questions that you guys left me from my last Q&A. So if you guys want to be um, in a Q&A or if you have any questions for me, just leave them in the comments in this Q&A, and I will answer them in the next one. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it. So the first question is, do you read all the comments? And I do, and I try to answer as many as I can. Obviously, it's hard to like talk to everybody and get back to everybody. But um, I really love interacting with you guys, and I love reading what you guys have to say. So when you guys re leave comments, it's, like, awesome because I love it so much. And, like, I will literally sit at my computer and, like, refresh my YouTube over and over again just to see if, like, someone leaves a new comment because I'm weird like that, and I'm a dork. So <laughs> I love it when you guys read uh, – you don't read. Well, you do, but okay. I love it when you guys leave comments. Um, it's awesome. I – I read all of them, so you guys are really great, and I love the comments y'all leave, so you guys are awesome. So the next question is, do you play FIFA, or have you ever played FIFA? And I actually have a lot of friends that play FIFA, so I definitely have. I don't own FIFA, but um, it looks like a couple of you would be down for me to do some like NHL, FIFA games, and um, I'm, I know my friends are down to play those games with me, so um, I might put, the, put future um, videos of that on my channel, I don't know, but I actually really like FIFA. Um, FIFA and NHL are the only two, like, games, um, sports games that I like, so, yeah, those are fun. <laughs> Next question is, how old were, uh, I can't talk today, um, <laughs> how old were you when you started gaming, and what was your first game? I was pretty young, like, back in the Pokemon days, that's kind of what I played a lot, was Pokemon and Mario. Those are my two, like, things growing up, um, as a kid. I don't really remember how old I was, probably, like, six or seven, somewhere around there. Um, I was always kind of a big tomboy, so um, I was always kind of into the boy things growing up. So I always played Pokemon with all the boys, and um, we played like four-wheeling races on the PlayStation and stuff like that. So yeah. What would you do if a meteor was coming and going to destroy the U.S.? Where would you move in England? Uh, London Watford and Huddersfield. I think I said those right. I honestly have no idea what the first two are, or not the first two, the last two. Um, but I've always actually really wanted to go to London, so probably just move to London. So next question is, would you ever twerk and put it on your channel? Probably not. Um, I, like, I don't know. I don't want to do that. <laughs> like, and I get asked, you guys ask me to twerk all the time. Um, not saying I can't twerk, because I can, but I'm not going to, so something crazy would have to happen in order for me to do that on my channel. Like, I would have to get 100,000 subs tomorrow for me to twerk on my channel, which is, like, never going to happen. So, yeah, like, I probably will never make a twerking video. How much do you miss Steve Ravgab? Um, you know you do. I honestly have no idea who this person is. But he, like, constantly stalks me, and it's really creepy. So I just, it, like, I'm getting really scared. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He's my friend. Don't, like, send him weird messages. <laughs> but, yeah, Steve, I miss you. Okay, next question. <laughs> Next question is, do you have a wiener? And I'm pretty sure in one of my videos I said I have a vajiji. And so, yeah, I don't have a wiener. And if you don't know what a vajiji is, then you're too young. So, next question. Are your glasses for real? And, yeah, my glasses actually are real. My vision isn't that bad, so they're not, like, like pretty much anybody could wear them. Um, but I need them mostly when I drive just because I can't see the street signs from far away And it's not until like it's too late that I see what the sign says and then like and then I have to like take a u-turn Go back um, But I just wear them all the time because this is like my third pair and I lose them all the time in their Ray-Ban So they're like 200 plus dollars So yeah, but my vision's actually getting worse. So my prescriptions probably gonna go up anyways But yeah, no my glasses are real. They're not just for looks have or would you ever dye your hair and I don't know if you mean like colors like rainbow colors or just like natural colors um, I've never dyed my hair like any rainbow like blue or purple or something but um, I actually dye my hair all the time and okay not all the time um, but 
I get really bored with my hair easily, and so I'm always, like, doing different stuff to it. Um, I've had, like, blonde highlights. I've had red highlights. I've had, like, just black or dark brown. I've had light brown. So I, I mix up my hair a lot. I actually am hopefully going to go get my hair done this weekend and do the ombre effect, and I'm sure half of you don't even know what the hell that is, but I posted a picture on Twitter. But, yeah, so that'll be cool, I guess, if I can get that done this weekend. But, yeah, so I definitely have dyed my hair, though. Next question is, will you ever vlog without your glasses? And I don't know. Um, I feel, like, really naked without my glasses just because I wear them all the time. And for any of, like, I think people that have glasses will understand this. When you take your glasses off, like, you just feel like your eyes are so small and your forehead is so big. And I just, I can't. I hate not wearing my glasses now. If you really want me to do a vlog without my glasses, I can totally do that. Uh, but yeah, I I usually just leave my glasses on. Next question is, will you go out with me? I'll take you to Disneyland. Uh, if you come to my house and you say we're going to Disneyland, I'm getting in the car. So, although, don't like find out where I live because that's really creepy. And yeah, so. <laughs> if a potato chickled then what is iceberg toasters I know there's a logical explanation for this one but I'm obviously just not that smart to answer it um, so yeah I don't know sorry next question is what games are you most excited about this year and I am like so ready for Titanfall to come out I cannot wait I don't have the Xbox one yet uh, I'm still on my 360. Really, I'm just still on my 360 because I don't see a reason for me to have the Xbox One just yet. Um, I mean, you can't record game chat as far as my understanding is. And um, I don't know. I just, and I really just don't have the money for it right now. So um, I'll definitely be getting the Xbox One relatively soon, probably after I move and do all that. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited for Titanfall. Not really, like, I haven't really heard about any other games, um, or I, I just can't think of them right now, but Titanfall is definitely the one that, like, sticks out to me the most. Alright, next question is, what position did you play in hockey? And I was actually center. I really love center. Um, I mean, I played at a pretty young age, so I pretty much played everywhere, um, on the ice, but center was the position that I loved the most. Next question is, what would you rather be eaten by a pack of wolves or freeze to death while watching Beauty and the Beast? Definitely freeze to death while watching Beauty and the Beast, because getting eaten alive sounds pretty, like, sad. <laughs> but um, I freaking love Beauty and the Beast. I love that movie. And if I could watch it all the way through and then I'll die, like, at least it'll be, like, with happy thoughts, because it's, like, happy ever after. And yeah, <laughs> so, but yeah, freeze to death, I guess. When your parents aren't home and you're all alone, do you, you know, pretend to be a pickle? <laughs> all the time. Alright guys, so that's it for this q and I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Um, I answered as many questions as I could. Um, if you guys like this video, please leave a like, and if you guys want me to answer any questions that you guys have for the next Q&A, leave them in the comments on this one, and next time I do a q and I'll be scrolling through these comments and answering all your questions on this video. So again, um, thank you guys, I love y'all, and I'll talk to you soon.